The period of September 15th through October 15th is celebrated as National Hispanic Heritage Month. UTC is hosting an event on Thursday to recognize the diverse Latin community on campus. Riley Nagel met with faculty members to find out what to expect on the 22nd. Lupton Hall will be filled with students and faculty Thursday celebrating Hispanic Heritage Month with food, music, and guest speakers. And professors speaking at the event say while it will be a blast, they're really hoping the students will be inspired by the stories of perseverance. My father was a first generation college student. He actually put himself through college and um, he did so playing minor league baseball and soccer in Mexico. Nicolasa Tejero, Associate Dean of Arts and Sciences, will be one of the honored guests speaking at Thursday's event. What Hispanic Heritage Month means to us. Tejero says they partnered with Latina professionals of Chattanooga and UTC's Hispanic leadership organization, OLA, to prepare for the occasion. I also hope there's a lot of celebration <laughs> because it is about celebrating our heritage, celebrating our roots, um, celebrating our culture. She says the theme of the event will be Unido, meaning united. There are things that connect us, there are things that um, unite us, but there is such variety, there's such diversity. Tejero says each Hispanic person's story is unique depending on what country they come from or even the story of how their family immigrated to the States. Tejero plans to share her journey and her family's story, hoping to inspire others in the community they can achieve their goals. The idea of see it, be it, the idea of it is possible, si se puede, it es posible, si se puede. Tejero says her parents showed her through tenacity and determination anything is possible. Now she encourages others in the Latin American community and students on campus to show up on Thursday, connect with faculty members, and help lift up Chattanooga's Hispanic heritage. What better way to get to know somebody than by hearing them tell their own stories? Reporting in Chattanooga, I'm Riley Nagel, Local 3 News.